likes of Oji Uzo Kalu can rule Nigeria, IBB. What's up, guys? Welcome back to 2K Spark. <clears throat> Former military president Ibrahim Badamosi Babangida, IBB, has named a former governor of Abia State, Dr. Oji Uzo Kalu, as a suitable choice to take over the presidency of the country, saying it was saying it will be in Nigerians' interest. Babangida said. This comment in the documentary aired on AIT on Sunday. This is after his highly publicized interview with Arise TV, where he highlighted on the kind of personality that would be suitable to lead the country in 2023. In the video scene, um, in the video, the interviewer had asked the former president questions bordering on the future leadership of the country he said he would he asked him how do you like the leadership of nigeria to be addressed because it will appear that since you left perhaps um general sania bacha we we uh, we have as well had general basanjo as president when he came in he provided leadership but after that I think in experience, in his experience, that leadership thing has been lacking, which is why in Nigeria it seems as it seems to be ruderless. How will you advise? The former military leader said, "We are running and we will be running a democracy, but we haven't reached the level. We didn't have the democracy, democratic intuition." that are working very well our intuitions must be above parties and politics and so on and so forth you have to have a lot of knowledge be it business be it academics and so on and i feel everybody even every politicians at certain age must aspire obama is just making 60 years old after seven two times in the united states so as Clinton and so on and so forth. So we can have the likes of Oju Zokalu who is interested in running the country and why not? Babangida said. So guys, this is very interesting coming from IBB and he's saying that Oji Uzokalu is going to be a perfect person, perfect president, perfect Igbo president coming that will come out in 2023. Well, he didn't actually state stated the exact reason why he feel Oju Kalu would do better, why he he wants Oju Kalu to be there, but he just said that Oju Kalu would do a better job. Oju Kalu, yeah, would do. He said that Oju Kalu would do a better job. Oju Oju Kalu is a former governor of Abia State. So guys, this is really interesting and this is really um, amazing coming from him. Well, we do hope everything turns out good. 2023, what Nigeria actually need is a patriotic leader, somebody with vast knowledge in so many areas that can help out solve all these problems, especially problems of security and economy. Those are the major areas we are definitely lacking. So we need somebody that can tackle those problems for us. So guys, if you have any contribution, can you leave it in the comment section? Thank you very much for watching. See you next time. Now, um, with the benefit of hindsight, how would you like the leadership uh, question in Nigeria to be addressed? Because it will appear that since you left, and perhaps General Sani Abacha, we have, uh, well, General Obasanjo as president when he came in provided leadership. But after that, I don't think, uh, in my experience, uh, so that leadership thing had been lacking, which is why Nigeria is, seems to be ruderless. How will you advise? Uh, you just have to be prepared to be very, very, very tough. Because it is true, we are running and we will be running a democracy. But it's not, 
we haven't reached the level where we didn't have, we don't have the institutions of democracy that are working very well. That our institutions must be above partisan politics and so on and so forth. You have to have a lot of knowledge, be it business, be it um, academic and so on. And I feel everybody, every politician, no matter a certain age, must aspire to become Obama is just making 60 years old after serving two terms in the United States. So was Clinton and so on and so forth. So we can have a lot of these bright Uzo Carlos like who will be interested in running the country and why not?